following trailer is rated S for spoilers. Shouldn't be rated H for honest. Isn't that what they did? Come on, Andy Signore. Oh my gosh, I can do it, I can do it. I did not get my Darth Vader cape, though. This is my epic trailer voice. I can usually go real deeper. Hold on. Alright. <clears throat> Alright, let's do this. Dang, come it. I... Honest Trailers, The Force Awakens. Honest Trailers, The Force Awakens. Let's get on with this. Dang, gum it. I can do a really good Honest Trailer voice. And then when I really want to do it, it never comes out right. Let's see. Let's get on with this. <clears throat> Let's get on with this. I think I actually got it. Alright, oh, dang, gum it. seen this movie. Yes, I have. Star Wars The Force Awakens. I think I'm trying to get a hold of it now. From the company that owns everything you know and love, Disney, Pixar, and Marvel. Spielberg. Comes a movie that had to satisfy decades of pin-up nerd expectations. Make up for the prequels. Introduce a franchise to a new generation of fans. Make enough money to justify Disney's $4 billion investment. And also, you know, be good. So... Star Wars The Force Awakens. The Force has awakened, and its first order is to revitalize the franchise while setting the stage for an amazing expansion of the Star Wars cinematic universe by shamelessly remaking a new hope. What the? Who are you? I'm the original Honest Trailer voice, and the originals are always better. Yeah, you. You win. What the crap? No, but. Oh my god. Is that the, I've got the best movie of the year to talk about. Hold on, guys. What on earth is going on here? Why is it stuttering like that? I'm sorry, guys. I don't know why it's doing this. Man, it always looks good. Right there. No, 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 no. Darn it. I may need to pause for this. Hold on. Best? Oh, man. I'm not going anywhere. Someone has to stop you from going full fanboy. Oh, I've got a bad feeling about this. All your favorite characters are back for another adventure. Leia, Chewie, Han, and they all look really old. Uh, okay, but these living legends are passing the torch to a new generation of heroes like Rey, an orphan scavenger who's so poor she has to make her own Star Wars action figures. She's a multilingual expert mechanic slash ace pilot slash force using badass who's so good at everything it makes her character completely uncompelling. Yeah. How dare you? I mean, Somewhat. come on. How is she so good at everything? Because, you know, she has the force and it's awakening. And the Force makes you awesome. That's not how the Force works. Shut up, Han Solo. God. But Rey's not the only one obsessed with Star Wars. Meet Kylo Ren, a brooding Jedi outcast, torn between his family legacy and the dark side. Never before has Star Wars had a villain so layered, so complex, and so whiny. He acts like a goth kid who can't find his eyeliner. You know what? Darn. Keep butting in. Why don't you just take over? Now we're talking. No. Kira Boy felt so desperate to recapture the magic of the first Star Wars. It practically is the first Star Wars. Featuring a desert orphan finding a key droid with top secret information who escapes the Empire thanks to the Millennium Falcon. Visits a shady cantina. Learns about the Force from a tiny alien. Watches a man apply kill her mentor. Then helps destroy a Death Star by deactivating a shield generator. Star. Oh man. But it's so much more than a rehash of everything that made a new hope great. It's got all new stories to tell, like Finn, a conflicted first order stormtrooper turned rebel, hunky badass Poe Tamarin, <laughs> and don't forget Captain Phasma, an awesome looking stormtrooper commander who is completely wasted in just 91 seconds of screen time that end with her useless character getting thrown in the garbage. Yeah, they totally wasted Breathe of Tarth. 
but get ready to speculate. But she's back. Plants the seeds of questions that will drive fans wild with anticipation. Like, who is Snoke? Who are Ray's parents? Yeah. And why does R2D2 suddenly wake up? Plus, questions that will annoy the rest of the fans. Like, why does R2D2 suddenly wake up? Why is everyone in the galaxy either a Skywalker or a Solo? And why would we expect the guy who made Ross to have good answers for any of these questions? Where'd you get that? A good question. For another time. Man, is there anything we can agree on about this movie? I don't know. I would only count on three. We name our favorite parts. Ready? One, two, three. Kyle Ren stops a blast from old. Fly through a crash or destroyer. Oh, Dameron's beautiful face. And Black Bar. Okay, now Lee's favorite. Leia hugging Ray instead of Chewie after Han Solo dies. Did we just become best friends? Yes. Story. <laughs> Play AARP. Mary Sue. Better Anakin. FN2187. Hey, that's my pin number. Han Polo. <laughs> Emperor Voldemort. Art D22. Han Solo. A waste of the perfectly good no way cast. The easiest money Mark Hamill ever made. And but why? <laughs> Star Wars, a familiar hope. <laughs> well, nice meeting you, other epic voice guy. May the voice be with you. Hey guys, any reason why you didn't invite me? Who are you? I voiced the first ever honest trailer, remember? In 3D! Oh gosh. Hey guys, don't forget about me. I did Apple. Avatar. Oh man, I love how you said bloobs. 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 <laughs> oh, come on. Bloobs. Hey guys, I heard you were having a voice party. How'd you all get in here? I got some pizza rolls in my underwear if you want some. Maybe you should consider locking your booth. Be sure to subscribe for more honest trailers. Is there been four uh, guys? I remember those three. I don't remember that one guy, though. It's time for another the first, very first one. up with the awesome team from How Would You Have Ended for an exclusive brand new show, After Credits, where we give our favorite movies the after credit scenes they deserve. Click the box to watch the first episode for Interstellar right now. We'll drop yeah. more new episodes each and every month exclusively on Screen Junkies Plus. So crack open the bookcase and watch our first episode right now. Merv! I cannot. Oops. Like you said it in Game of Thrones Honest Trailer. Welcome aboard the SS Bodie McBoatface. Hi, I'm Negan. Luke, I am not your father. I am a potato. Honey, where are my pants? M. Night Shyamalan is the best director to ever live. My name is Crap Bag. First name Crap, last name Bag. Fool of a Duke. Winner. Is come. Come on. We can't do Star Wars. The Force Awakens. We just did. I wonder why they did that. Hold on, hold on. Okay, that was pretty funny. Come on. So delete that. I cannot believe they did that to Han. Hans. No, no, no. Not Cher. Come on. What would they say? Han. So gone or something like that? Alright. Uh, I think we're done for today. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you all enjoyed this video. I'm sorry if this thing stuttered a little bit. I don't know why they did that. Hi, that. Alright. And I'm going to go eat some more dinner, so thanks for watching, guys, and check out the other videos I did tonight, and stay tuned for Friday when we do our first true Jurassic chat.